Good morning, Internet. Welcome to another adventure. Today, I'm with the club. How are you today, sir? Topolific. Club, you know where we're going to today? We're at Kawasaki, so I assume we're going to ride some Kawasaki. Actually, we're headed to Colton, where we're going to ride one of Honda's newest bikes. Today's gonna be kind of a long day. I'm gonna tell you what's gonna happen. Here's the chain of events. It's 6.30 in the morning. The club and I are headed all the way out to Colton to the Honda Rider Safety Court to ride one of their brand new bikes. I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet. You're just gonna have to stick with us and see. But it should be a fun day. Honda's gonna have some breakfast for us when we arrive. I'm sure they're gonna go over some of the talking points about the bike. Then we're gonna get on these things and we're gonna go up the hill to Big Bear where we're gonna have lunch and then back. Ultimately, the day should go smoothly. I wonder what they're gonna have for breakfast. I'm hungry. I guess I'll tell you what it is that we're riding. What do you think I am, Motonocity? It's a CB300. It's not a bike that you'll ever find in my garage, but it's a bike nonetheless. I know a lot of you guys that watch my channel are entry-level riders or are still in the thinking about getting a bike phase. So that's why I agreed to come out and ride this bike because it's a relevant bike to you guys. And it's important for you guys to know what's out there. Chances are I'm not gonna be able to tell you if this bike's good or bad, but I can tell you if it's fun. I'm a pretty good judgment of fun. <laughs> and if I can't be a good judgment of fun, he will be. I don't feel like we're going the right way. I'm looking a little bit lost, buddy. What's going on? I don't know, GPS told me to get off the freeway and I don't know why. Smash the phone. Hey, Johnny, how you doing, buddy? All right, buddy. We got the cracky boo hanging out. Surprisingly, we're not lost. Let's continue. Okay, I think we're here. We're so early, too. Yo, we're here at the Education Center. You ready to learn how to ride? <laughs> talk to my son in front of these people. Uh, these are all industry professionals and I'm an industry owned professional. Look at this. Delinquent. All right, well, here we go. So we went through this whole entire presentation on this bike. It's really kind of amazing. It weighs just over 300 pounds, man. You can tell. It is super light. Nimble too. peppy for 300 seriously i thought it'd be kind of shitty getting on the freeway but it's not it's good it's like smooth solid cruising at about 70 at about 7500 rpm and it looks like it redlines at 11 yeah we got more to go i'll try to top it out for you guys towards the end of the day i should get into the habit of using my blinkers i don't know where they're at i think i see them horn button's huge on this thing can't miss that There it is. Cool little bike, right? I like it. That was the ride. Hope you guys had a good time. <laughs> <laughs> what we're going to do here, first photo stop, basically this road right out here in front of you. Just a couple of blocks down, Colin's going to station himself. Drew's going to be over here in the grass, and we're going to do two passes. You're recording me. You're going to fill up your car if you're not mature with your All space. Right. I'm following you. Don't follow me. You're going to get lost. They're hiding in the bushes. I see them. my hat in here man I don't want to look lumpy in photos you know <laughs> make sure they get your good side yeah <laughs> I hate feeling lumpy all right dude's hiding in the bushes there he is do I have good body position good BP oh, I drive a Prius do any of you have an opinion on that Driving a Prius? Yeah. I do too. It's a, oh, really? Yeah. Fast cars, eh? See that? We're making friends. You need to get on that. I'm not getting on that. Get on it. I'm not. What are we doing now? Back to the curb? What's that? Yeah, yeah. I pretty much go back to the same spot. After this BMW, you're good to go. So. All right.
I didn't see the dude in the bushes. All right, so uh, from here we will head to some curves. Some curves. So in our presentation, they said that we were going to ride up the hill to Big Bear. Then we're going to have a nice lunch at a place called Hacienda, which I assume is Mexican. Look at this desert land. This is cool. This thing's wide open now. I really want to see how fast it goes. Wide open. I think he's going to pass the school bus. I think he should pass the school bus. I think the school bus is going to let us pass. Thank you, sir. So during our presentation, Hanu was explaining what this bike does and who it's for. It's for entry-level riders and, and girls. And I could totally see why. This bike is a confidence booster. If you've ever been afraid of motorcycles and you hopped on one of these, it puts you right at ease. It really would. It's comfortable. It's good. It's predictable. The controls are intuitive, man. It's a good bike. This is the kind of bike that I'd consider buying for my wife and I'd feel real good about setting her loose on it. It's not a dangerous bike. All bikes go fast enough to kill you, so don't get me wrong there. This is the bike that's not gonna kill you quite as fast. I don't know why I'm talking about death and motorcycles all at the same time, it's kinda of stupid, but. So where are we right now? Are we at Taco Bell yet? We're almost to the headquarters. We're almost to Taco Bell. So that little twisty section, like when you come up over, you see that whole little S band section. So that's yeah, kind of going to be the, the little next part of the stop. Yeah. So Drew will be getting set up, and then and John will send you guys one at a time. You can stop up there. We'll sit up, get some good shots. Good place to take a piss. Say cheese. I'm not real sure where we're supposed to turn around at. So you guys came up together the first time? You want to go separate? Yeah, we'll go separate. Okay. This makes me laugh. <laughs> Spirit the liquid. Uh, and I didn't even put it there. Honda did. Are the cameras on the left or the right? I didn't see him last time. He was on the right that time, but he's moved this time. So. so for this shot, he's gonna be. So he's gonna be in the kind of the opposing lane a little bit. When you come through that section, if you can get closer to the, the center line, it'll make for a better shot. So is that basically you record all the time or you what? record periodically or all the time? It's on and off, on and off. Oh really? I got it hooked up to a power bank. Ah, uh, okay. So. Waters? Oh. You're still here. good, 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 good. Wow. So, if you guys did want a, a shot with both of you in it, he said this would be a good time. I don't know, it's up to you. If not, you don't have to. Yellow school bus from the bottom. Well, Yellow school, school bus on the bottom. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, I like it a lot. For a woman rider? Well, you know, for like a girl bike. <laughs> I hate when people use that term. Oh, I know. Oh, I hate it. I know. Next stop, burritos. You know what I'm craving? Fajitas. I think that's what I'm gonna get, man. Bring that big old sizzly platter. Yeah, steak. We're gonna get steak today. Slow. 
lug bug pow. Look at this Camaro. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, get the burger. I went there. Who remembers that video? Used to be a Pinto outside, but there's not now. This is us. Hacienda. I smell it. I'm so hungry. I'm gonna leave my mark. Hacienda, what'd you think, man? I'd give it a 16 million on the Scoville scale. It was pretty good, you know. Good. Yeah, not too bad of a spot. Yeah. Price was right. I'll be back tomorrow, two days from now, next day. What do you think of the bikes so far? I love them. I'm going to buy 34 of them. 34? 35. Well, we're not quite done. We're going to do some more riding. I think we're going to go down the hill and then back to the Honda Center. And then from there, Honda. back on the GSXR and home. I'm not going to give my full opinion until I'm ready to turn in the key for this dude. Aye, aye, sir. Runs over pine cones real well. Hacienda. This place is pretty good. Get the burger. Where's the Pinto? Still not there. Hello there. How you doing? Right. Look at this, man. It's all dried up. I think this used to be a lake. I guess it is still a lake. Just a smaller lake. I wonder how many people have houses up here that are just like their summer house. I bet a lot, considering there's probably not a whole lot of work up here, right? It's like serious fun going downhill. It was a lot of fun uphill too. It's a whole nother beast though, down. I love it. Couldn't really carry that speed. Oh man, we're on the home stretch now. I'm actually a little sad to say goodbye to her. Look at this, dude. They don't make them like that anymore, man. This thing's got a lot of style to it. Oh my God, that's so gross. I just sneezed in my helmet. Look at that, that's a cool little jump. Kinda wanna go back and hit it. That was a fun day, a real fun day. Thanks Honda for bringing us out, man. Good time. Trail factory, oh, not yeah. donuts. Yeah. Dude, these bikes were great. CB 300R, all day, man. All day we rode those things. I thought I wasn't, I didn't think I was gonna like it nearly as much as I did. I really didn't. And as far as a beginner bike goes, for sure. If you're looking for a beginner bike, this is definitely something you should include in your list of possible purchases. As soon as I start riding, I'm probably gonna get one myself. <laughs> Thanks, Honda, for bringing us out here. Thank you, guys. Yeah, you guys know how I feel about this bike. I've been bragging about it the whole time. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you haven't yet, subscribe. Make sure you go over to Cleb's channel, see what he's got to offer. Big shout out to all the Patreons. Without you guys, man, I would not be here. Thank you so much. Huge shout out to the channel sponsors, Chaparral Mo the law offices of Henry Haddad and Voss Helmets. Also check out SuburbanDelinquent.com. Get all the latest and greatest. I'm always adding new stuff there. With that, I'll catch you guys later.